Time Dropper fam, back home in more ways than one. Los Angeles, but of course back to Staples Center for the continuation of our Clippers season. Missed three games, home games in a row, Charlotte, Miami, and Portland. But we're back here from Minnesota for Pat Bev's return. I'm very excited to see him, give him a nice hand, stand up for his video. Great four years here. I'm gonna keep the selfie video to a minimum because the screen is still cracked and I, I gotta give you guys better quality than this. So I'm gonna see you guys at the game and I'm gonna try to get the screen quick, screen fixed as quick as possible. I should go in with a Twitter follower, mutual follower to a game to the game today. Dime Dumber fam is growing, Twitter, YouTube. If you ever actually wanna go to a game with me, holler at me because not everybody's Clipper fan. So I, I'm always looking for people to go with. And yeah, hit me up. Go to Alexander, Chapman for three, bingo! Get it for the win. Got it. Got it. He is hard to believe. Here's Jordan. Yes. The magic of 360 turn with the dribble. Magic down the middle. Gets underneath the worthy. Slam dunk. I also want to say we've won six in a row. Time to make it seven in a row, baby. I want that eight and four start. Let's go. Here we are. Here I am. I'll take that fucking drink now. City Edition debut jerseys.
A little bit of another seat upgrade. Unreal. Rolling on absolutely all cylinders right now. 16 for Reg. Sue doing work. Even Eric's having a good game. The 12 points for Eric. Jesus. 28 from our backcourt. Let's go. And then. Uh... Oh, it says number one, Reggie Jackson. That is his second. Clippers, what's your thoughts at halftime so far? You know what? It's been great defense, great offense. The transition, Blackout needs to keep driving in. It's been all great. They need to keep up the pace, the energy in the second half. They do that, we just put them away. So it's great, great first half. There we go. Thank you, man. Go yes, sir. Good job, 
Yes, come on, that's Mouse in the house. Let's go, go to work. Oh, good hands. Five and nine for Eric. Who are you passing to? Yeah. I have one goal. It's to get J Mac in the game. And Finch is being a bitch. He's not putting him in. Garbage. Well, as good of a performance as you can ask for on both ends of the floor. You know, after seeing the Lakers get destroyed by these guys last night, I thought there was a chance it would be a tough game, but we came out with the right energy, both ends, defended extremely well, lively, and of course made all the right reads on offense. Shout out to Paul George, Reggie Jackson, for getting in that pick and roll, putting Cat in that pick and roll a lot, and he's not a switchable guy, so we just made the right reads. They trapped, hit guys in the short roll, swung to the corners and got open threes all night long. PG and Reggie hit mid-ranges, which kept the defense honest. And Luke Kennard, Terrence Mann, Isaiah Hardenstein did their thing again. And they continue to do their thing. And we are just rolling on all cylinders right now. Seven in a row. Zubats I thought was great, double-double. Hardenstein basically got a double-double off the bench. And Carl Anthony Towns, man, I got to see him tonight. This dude has mismatches every time down the court. Terrence Mann, Justice Winslow, Batum guarding him, and he doesn't go to the post. They fight him a little bit, and he just stands at the three-point line and does nothing. He doesn't fight for position, doesn't go to the block. He doesn't put pressure on the officials at all, and he is the reason why I think this team will not make the playoffs. He holds them back because he's got all the talent in the world, and he's okay with scoring 12 points whatever he had tonight. A joke. We didn't put no shutdown guy on him, but hey. We are playing the right way. We are playing amazing. Paul George, MVPG. And a big thing is that we got rest tonight. Our starters didn't even play the whole fourth quarter, basically, which gives us rest for tomorrow's game against the Bulls, which is going to be huge and probably the biggest chance of our winning streak to snap. Shout out also to Reggie Jackson and Eric Bledsoe tonight, who were awesome. And when Reggie's hitting his shots, the whole team changes. And he has been the reason why we're on this winning streak, because he's found his shot and he's become the Reggie Jackson of last year. But when Eric Bledsoe's hitting his shot like he was tonight and getting to the rim, and scoring double figures like he was tonight, we're a totally different ball club. Another win, it's great to be back. Clipper Nation, you were great tonight. One of the best atmospheres of the season thus far. Probably, honestly, like maybe the best, besides the OKC game, which was a blowout, but great job by the fans. Very little Laker infiltration, and we move on to the next. Seven in a row, baby, sleep tight, Clipper Nation.